Hey guys, Tom Cherry, I'm the Linux MCE again. I uh, just wanted to give you kind of a quick little demo of what I'm working on right now. I decided that the uh, individual orbiter pads for Myth TV control were not ideal for any sort of use. The keypad was basically useless, and this is especially poignant when we start dealing with uh, channels on multiple tuners and multiple tuners may be connected to different sources that sort of thing. The, the keypad just doesn't work very well in this respect. Thankfully Myth TV does have a data grid that provides us all of the usable channels inside the system for each and, for each and every tuner complete with the station identifier and what is playing on it at that moment. Now I've gone ahead and I've modified Myth TV's uh, EPG here, I mean the uh, the Myth TV control here, uh, to output this as a data grid, and I changed the screen layout appropriately to do so. And I'll just kind of I'll just kind of show you real quick. In fact, the intro is going to be a lot longer than the uh, actual showing it. You see here we have our standard uh, Web DT366 orbiter, and we have right here. Just, we're watching some TV here. Uh, looks like the astronaut farmer right here. And um, I'm going to go ahead and just tap the display. Once the display pops up, you can see that we now have, uh, hold on, let me pre-position this a bit better. We now have our orbiter display, and we have here basically just a list of channels and everything that what we're watching at this particular moment, right at this point in time. Now, due to the fact that data grids are a little buggy right here, I went ahead and added pagination buttons here on the bottom so you can flip through the individual channels. And of course, all you have to do is simply select one of them. And if, once you select one of them, it will automatically tune the it will tune everything automatically. Now, I think I picked a channel with that with that's a little weak on frequency here, but there we go. So, yeah. I mean, so there you go. An efficient way to basically tune things if you're just watching TV. Finally, some workable EPGs here. How about some Iron Chef? Let's watch some Iron Chef. As you can see, when we change this, it will automatically change the d description here once it's tuned. So... So, yeah, there you go. Uh, until next time, I'll show you some more stuff of what I'm working on here. But hopefully this brings uh, Myth TV usage in Linux MCE one step closer to usability and to user-friendliness. Until next time, see you guys later. Bye-bye.